Delahoy has become a great body puncher, so his hands are... As little as 10 years ago, boxing was king. Names like Gracie and Couture took a backseat to De La Hoya and Tyson. But since then, mixed martial arts fighting has become a growing trend. Gyms across the country are popping up with caged fighting areas and teaching different types of martial arts. Pete Kozma, a Moldovan immigrant, earned his purple belt in a year and a half, which can take more than five years to achieve. I never thought that I'm like stronger than somebody, but when I start jiu-jitsu, Everybody was telling me, like, he's so strong and stuff, so I was like, okay, you know, but I wasn't really paying attention to whatever they're saying, you know what I mean? But later I felt like I can, I felt like I can use my strength uh, against the techniques, you know what I mean? Through Cosma, Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu has reached the Northeast from its origins in Japan. Cosma BJJ, located on Bustleton Avenue, offers varying styles of fighting lessons, including Muay Thai, boxing, and the obvious Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu. The students here range in ages from 14 to over 40, all competing and learning together. And the Northeast is just the place for a school like this to succeed. It's a lot of different nationalities, and Northeast feel is very, like, it's a lot of different. Polish, Russian, Ukraine, or whatever you name it. They hear the Northeast, so and it's a, it's a big population of young people here. But the odd thing about Brazilian Jiu Jitsu is it's not inherently Brazilian. Like Cosma, most of his students do not speak English as a first language, and most don't call the United States their native country. Yeah, some guys are, have Polish guys, they have uh, Moldovan guys, uh, Ukrainian. Lithuanian guys, Russian, it's all different. Plus I speak like four languages. But with the popularity this sport has gained, it transcends language. It's best to show rather than speak the techniques learned in Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu. And just like any sport, they've developed their own language both with signs and words to communicate what works. Fine. Good job, guys. Sean Gallagher, Philadelphia Neighborhoods, Northeast.